Dr. Jagdish, um, uh, everyone has their own way of defining diabetes, right? In very simple terms, just like any layman can understand, can you educate us what is diabetes, Dr. Jagdish? Yeah, very importantly that uh, we already know that first point is diabetes is a metabolic disorder. Okay? First thing. Second thing, what we observe basically, it is a chronically elevated blood sugar. Okay, so these are the two most important factors and then the next thing when we look into uh, the types of diabetes so it flows from the definition itself that basically there are two concepts if there is an absolute deficiency of insulin then it is a basically type 1 and maybe LADA also and next is there is a relative deficiency of insulin that's a type 2 or may also happen in GDM and many other conditions. So these are broadly classified into these two categories based upon the insulin. Next, then uh, pertaining to the type 2 because the type 1 diabetes basically it is less than 5% of the total number of diabetes are type 1. And mostly we see a type 2 diabetes patients and basically there is although we know that there is a relative reduction in the insulin secretion but the major factor which actually leading to the diabetes or what happens in the diabetes is insulin resistance why i am telling this because this is the most important thing if we work on that that is the pathway to reversal or keeping diabetes in remission so we will talk more about insulin resistance further. Sure, doctor.